Greetings, fellow Demon Slayers. This is Timon and Mari and Tack, and we're here today with another action Timon and video. So, people have expressed interest in us talking about the user rankings, so that's what we're gonna do. But honestly, my only opinion of this when I saw Ren on the initial vote was that Ren was gonna win. I'm pretty sure I said it. Yeah. And when the video, right. like when I, I'm like, I know everyone's gonna vote for Ren because all this co this community. All, like, okay, so, like, the moment I saw Rin there, I knew everyone was gonna vote for Rin, because she's the only thing on the list with tits and ass like Nui. <laughs> so I figured, like, all the cultured gentlemen here are just gonna vote for the biggest booba and booty. Like, it was just kind of, like, common sense. I totally also, um, just so people can uh, hate on Ark some more, Ark thinks Rin looks like a mutant and she's ugly. I mean, people already hate him with a passion, so there's no point. <laughs> people, people don't hate Ark, but he doesn't He doesn't find Rin attractive. He thinks her boobs and butt are way too big. Well, he's gonna have to kiss her ass now, because she won the fucking thing, so... <laughs> We're all gonna have to kiss her ass. <clears throat> uh, but, um, um... I thought We'll she, talk about well, it, my... but that's what I honestly think of it. Like, But we'll talk about how it ended up. But I knew you guys yeah, were gonna cause... pick Rin. I'm surprised, like, yeah. Grimory didn't. Surprised Mimi well, didn't know who she was. That was interesting. I think it's because here's what I was gonna say. I generally thought, like, I generally thought people were she was going to win, not because of like she was thick, because I didn't know how thick she was until people start sending pictures of her. It was basically because there was nothing in the game with her. Basically, like there was no supporter, no model, not a boss fight, nothing. Oh, so, so you think people were itching to just have something new? Yeah, just something, at least to have her something in, either as a supporter or not. Because some people thought, oh, is she going to have a supporter? Because her art looked like, like, supporter art. So it's like, th that was the thing, though, I will say this right now. I'm not surprised she won. We, I was with Mario on the boat, same boat. I was, it was either going to be her or Nagi that was going to win this. And the funny thing is that both have the same swords. Basically, they're dual blade users, so... At the very least, we'll have a dual blade user in our hands. Honestly, you know what I think? I think they already have the characters planned for this year, like they're just releasing them now. They already have them planned and they're already developing what they want. And as far as the poll, how much do you bet we get Ren for Christmas and she's busted like Morisaki? Like Morisaki and yeah, like no, Shiranu? No, no, yeah, like, like but Shizuru. Like... But Shizuru's not really busted, but like, uh... Yeah, every every good, every though. Christmas character is good. Yeah, that's the thing. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I would not be surprised. Like, I would not be surprised she shows up like early winter, basically early winter or late winter. She pops out, basically. I would not be surprised she pops out, basically at that time. But yeah, um, so Ren won. <laughs> Ooh, moving on. Yep. Yeah. All right. This so here's the, the actual word. full ranking. Um. I mean, Nagi's to be expected, because I asked people to vote for Nagi, and assuming anyone listened, that, that's by her votes. And I so, think people just want Nagi in general. I'm pretty sure she's, like, really heavily requested because we have her supporter. Also, Ultra is heavily campaigning in your server to vote for her ass, so... Yeah, Ultra <laughs> I, loves Nagi. I, I, yeah, so, like, this is, like, this is the character of the Ultra one, so... At the very least, I'm happy that she got at the least second spot, at the very least. The third one was a bit of a shock. I don't think so, because I mean, she, did I close this don't... crappy game? Yeah, I closed the crappy game. Let me open. <laughs> well, no, because I'll open it. But like, um, she's good because of um, her her intimacy, which that's why I'm opening the crappy game that we're talking about. <laughs> um, I, have I, you I seen was... her? You have her intimacy now, right? Yeah, I have her seen intimacy. It, yeah. I, I, I seen it. It's just like, I never really expected that enough to win her, basically. Well, that. the reason I think she's in third place is because people want to play her in this. It's too cute. Oh. It's adorable. It's like the best bunny skin ever. Look at her little black floppy ears. They're hers. Yeah, because it was, it was a bit random. Because I know if you awaken her supporter, she has like a giant mech behind her, basically. Let's just like... Ah, that's like... You know what? I wouldn't mind if she like I had never, a giant. I hate that about her, dude. She does just have that like giant mecha puncher thing. And she does have that when you awaken her art. So imagine playing uh, her as just that thing, just punching. That's like I wouldn't weapon. mind. That would be new. That would be new <laughs> as hell to play. I would. I would actually like that. Really. But um, yeah. Um. Tatsumi pumpkin spice. That's a, I mean, 
yeah, this is a shock because she's left. she's like okay, but she's not very good. But I mean, like, she, I... her hair is awesome. I can see people wanting her just for that. And the DC it's also wise. she has she also yeah I was gonna say she has the dual eye colors basically yeah. too, and she's like another sword. She'll be basically the second plant character if she ever gets added basically. So yeah, I'd get some punk with spice if she came out. It's weird because no one really talked about Pumpkin Spice that much. I've seen only like two people in the server talked about her, but that's about it though. So it really caught me off guard seeing her this high up in the list. Why? Her name's Tatsumi. Of course she's way up there. I like a Pumpkin Spice large. Hold the pumpkin. Alright. Um. Next is Itty Bitty Loli. I think I have to thank you for this, Mari. I think we have to thank you for this. What? Why me? You're the one who wanted her. No, 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 no. You basically said no because the thing is, when this vote happened, you said you wanted both Ultra and my characters to get up in the list, which this is the character that I voted for. Yeah, basically. but these people don't I, listen to me. I think that this is just a coincidence. I mean, it could be that. It also could be that she was in our 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 predictions characters coming up for this year too, which she was in that, and a lot of people did watch that. So. Uh, yeah, I would not be so like I'm actually I was a bit surprised how low Sora and I thought Sora would be the one higher than her because nah, I, I think I'm like the only person who likes Sora. You know what too? Like talking about them together, they're like both a huge cock. Like because they premiered with models before they ever even had a supporter, and they're not playable. Like I feel so robbed that these I characters think, yeah. too aren't playable. Yeah, there yeah. should have been a waifu war this month, and it should have had them both in it. Yeah, I think that, yeah. I like, think they that should just fit. do one once a year around this time. And they literally set themselves up to do one, and then they just didn't do it. That's why I don't get Grimry. They, like, they, it seems like they set themselves up to do some kick-ass shit, and then they just don't even do it. This is not even what they were planning in the first place. Like, how do you have yeah. a waifu war, then release two dual characters, like, the month after the waifu war, and then have people like, Wow, cool, this could be the next waifu war. And then a year later, when we're all itching for another waifu war and a freebie, you don't do it. Yeah, because from what... I did watch the video for this, and a lot of what I what I heard from Mimi said, they don't know what kind of playstyle that these two would have, basically. So they don't know what the hell to do with them, basically. Like, th they were, like, kind of scrambled, basically, for both, for both her and Kazuya, so... I, I think they don't know what to do with them, basically, as a playable character. I mean, they didn't know what to do with Kirara, but I've been playing that dumb bitch for a whole year. <laughs> so, I mean, that does, that's not an argument. That's not, like, any sort of... They didn't know what the fuck they were doing with Asuka when she came out. So... Uh, they know. <laughs> I mean, they know. like, <laughs> good excuse? <laughs> like, you know what I mean? We didn't know what we were doing. That's why, like, 90% of your characters suck. We already know you guys don't know what you're doing. And moving on from her, like, it'd be cool if her and Sora got an event together. It probably won't happen. At this point, I'm questioning if they'll ever be playable. Honestly, do you notice how these are gold and everyone else is purple? To me, that says, stays as a supporter if it's, like, anything that's, you know, not gold. So, like, the purple means it just doesn't ever get to be a character. They're just supporters. Only the top three I mean, get to be characters. Imagine that. And these are just, I mean, like, at the very bottom. Like, fuck you, you're common. I mean, they're all supporters, to be really honest with you. They are all I, supporters, but purple means you never get to be a character. You stay a supporter forever. But I, I would... S that would be depressing, <laughs> but they wouldn't They wouldn't have marked them in the... Um, in the... Like, the 4th through 10th, if they were not going to do anything with them, basically. So they, they have a chance... I agree, but... We'll go with it. Um... So next is I... I mean, she's basically just a free to free to play supporter. They just kind of like add it in. There's I don't really like care much about her. She's adorable, but the like outside of her, her intimacy, there's just not much of her. She's just I mean, here. yeah, yeah. Like I think the problem is too with her is that she, we already have a character like her, Tokiko. She basically yeah. is like she they basically share the same exact almost playstyle. I don't know how they would differate from them basically that's the only problem is like i get it she's cute and all but it's like if we have tokiko they have to really change the playstyle with hers basically and then we have yugi here um 
Now, this is surprising that she's this high. Because, I mean, I'd expect people to vote for the freaking... This platoon waifu here over her. Because it's a whole squid girl. I don't know... I don't know how she beat Kitty Mom. Or even Fan Mom, for that matter. Like, has anyone even talked about Yugi being hot ever? Like, no. she's cool, but, like, she's not... You know, she's not a Fan Mom. I, it's, I don't know. I'm just surprised she's even this high up. Because it, it's... Yeah, because it's weird, because she's basically... It's weird, because her playstyle is a bit, like... It's, it's weird, because in her art... It, it, it's not niche, it's just it's very weird, because... She, it is niche, it's a fucking more... line, you gotta, like... I guess it's not niche, but it's, like, it's a fucking line, it's death's conditional. To land it. I mean... On every, like, you know, I mean, you're trying to hit everything. I mean, I think her weapon is, like, two guns, and then they combine into a cannon, yeah, basically. It, yeah, she gets, like, a jumbo... Yeah, which it would be cool, honestly. I wouldn't mind either, but it'll be very difficult in how it's gonna work, basically. Do you see her? Where is she? Where is she? This is what her weapon does. This. this yeah, is it. yeah. It's like a, it's like a massive fucking. I wouldn't mind if this was the ulti if they would make her playable, but I don't know about making it as like a. Dude, if like this a... was the ulti, this would be the only character I ever play. Well, yeah, because this is giving you Fantasy Star... Yeah, this is like, like Fantasy Star vibes. as fuck, like, just Ranger Chon. Like, I would just literally... I would. I said I wouldn't pay for anything on this game anymore, but if she came out, I would well her if this was her ult. Like, if it was just Francis. 3D model, and it was this frame, like, just, and it ends with it blasting off the screen like this, and she's just sitting there, like, with her O face, hell yeah. It's the most satisfying what shit. What about a Francis joint? Ugh... <laughs> uh... <laughs> yeah, like, I, one day, day nope. one day. For... My new simp is this. She'll never be playable. <laughs> I will wail when she comes out. There. I would wail. There, Grimry, balls in your court. I balls. issued the challenge. Make sure I you mean, keep playable or you will not see another dollar from me. That's I mean, my, that's my, that's my, uh, decree. I mean, she's a chocolate wife, so there you guys go. More color yeah. to the mix. Coco Elf, man. All right. Alright, um... So we're on Fan Mommy now. I mean, fan her supporters mom. suck, so she just needs to be playable for some sort of redemption. Yeah, because honestly, like, I, I, like, her support, her intimacy, and then her, like, the art of the support is really nice. Like, she gives a nice crimson color with her fan. Plus, there's another place that we don't have, like, a dual wailing, like, fan users, which is, like... Yeah, and I can, can tell you from experience, they're really fucking fun to play because they're a character like that. Characters like that in Warriors Orochi that use dope dual fans. I should know too, because I remember you used Yumi too in Bla in Cross Tag too. Yumi does yeah. that too. As Yumi, well. Yeah, Yumi does that too. She's really good. Yes. Fun. Yes. The, so... I mean, I, yeah, that's. I, I don't. I can see her being this high. I could even see her being higher. Because she's adorable. Um, It's just that, you know, she's not really popular. Because she's not good. And as far as Kitty yeah, Mom, it, what, were you, what are you guys doing? Why is she in ninth place? What happened here? I saw, I saw a lot of hype voting for people voting for her. Like, I saw it a lot in the social medias. Yeah, like, I know for a reason. fact, like, Fox would Fox want this because she's furry. Yeah. Yeah, I, yeah I, and I, like, I, I remember, yeah, because I remember seeing a lot of people voting for her. I was expecting her to be top five, but the fact that she's not even, like, she's top ten, but, like, Kind of a bit of a surprising, honestly. Yeah, it really is, cause like, like I could see her above Tatsumi. Like oh, these yeah, make 100%. sense. Also, when Shisui comes out as playable, um, she won't have a limited support, cause you will be expected to have gotten her supporter for mileage. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that was suck ass. That's grimmery uh, for you. All right. Uh, um, yeah, that would suck. So we have Sato um, Kaiba then... here. Um, Kaiba, which, that's another one that surprised the shit out of me. Kaiba, too, like, literally got the last spot, basically. I'm less surprised about her than I am about this. Yeah, I would say, yeah, if you would have flipped them around, I would have be like, yeah, I would be more okay with that, yeah. Like, I feel like she should be, like, up in here somewhere, like, by, in, maybe even an I spot. I really crept up there for being a fucking random insert, late, like, you know... Because they added her to the game, like, right around the time they did this. Yeah. she was brand yeah. new. Yeah, and everyone got her. Every, like, free to play can get her easily. Kaiva is just, like, no one knows her that much. It's, except if you got her supporter, basically. Here we have Uraru. 
And again, this I don't know I was... she's so low, because she's good for one. I know people use them if they're playing their machine rifles. And the other yeah. thing about her is she's a fucking Splatoon Ingrid. She's adorable. Yeah. She's really, like, I, I was a bit surprised she's not in the top ten, too. She's this is another character. Mechanic mod. The only thing I would say, though, is that the only problem is I'll be afraid of her being a playable character if she was a playable character. You want to know why? I... It's because she she uses familiars as her sorts of oh, damage. Oh god, yeah, she'd be dirt. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's the that, that, that's the only problem. I, I I would like I would be I would like her, but I'll be scared, dude, because you saw what happened with familiars. Like even Sakura's like frog, her bear, and her spider. They don't like they don't do enough damage, so I'll be scared as shit if she was playable. Honestly, I would like her, but they need to increase her familiar damage if she ever became like playable. Bro, imagine. <clears throat> all the familiar shit that's been coming out, like, just that they've just been, you know, like, sprinkling in along the way. Imagine when she comes out, all those familiar supporters are, like, busted on her. I can easily see her, and plus she'll be <coughs> another- She'll be a, a machine character right off the bat, because she yeah. uses machines. Yeah, but that's yeah, what we need I, to talk about. Screw the user ranking. Next machine win? Uh, like, it's been if almost you look at the year. rank- It's been over a year since we've gotten our last machine. Yeah, it literally has been, because Sasuke was the last one. Seriously, dude. Um, Alright, so we have next, uh, Haru Haru. Um, our trap, our famous trap, yeah, basically. our reverse trap mommy. I like Haru. I mean, it looks yeah, like a boy, cool. but... She, I think that's the only problem, is yeah. that... I, I, wouldn't, I wasn't surprised she was this low, because she looked like a guy, and people yeah. still don't... Yeah, she's, people still she's, see got, she's got small booba. Yeah, that's true. No, so you no, guys are gonna no. notice a trend. You notice the, the the closer we get to the bottom, the smaller the booba gets on average. Yeah, I could tell. Right yeah, the, the bat, small yeah. booba, small booba, small booba, not fully yet realized booba, small booba, w fucking runs all the time booba, so has none. And Valkyria Chronicle characters have no booba; they're not allowed. Um, if you're, yeah, yeah. As far as Water Rase though, she'd be cool playable because of the gravity thing with her hammer. That'd be like a cool thing to put in her kit. Yeah, she's also um, another. Uh, she's also another um, typing we don't have, which is a hammer user. Murasaki's mostly an axe user, so yeah, she would be cool if they would have made her playable. But I'm not surprised that she's not this low. But yeah, it would have been cool seeing like a gravity character focused with hammer, basically. Yeah, it really would have. And I'm not surprised she's this low either. Yeah, this is whatever. Like, who cares? Um, Sora, I'm surprised she's here, but it is what it is. And, again, we already talked about it. These two need to just release together at some point, so moving on. I think I mean, Ronnie... Oh, wait, what were you going to say? Because yeah. I, I, like, uh, we already I, talked about her, so... No, uh, what I was going to say is that... Yeah, we did talk about her. But because Sakuya is this high, there's a chance that they will release them together now like I, I would say just last point of her because Sakuya is this high they may intend releasing Sora with her basically yeah just to get the, the duo like yeah just done to get, once, yeah just yeah. to get them out yeah just get them out there now so people don't like have to vote for her anymore basically well, I'm gonna say this everyone watching like <clears throat> if these come out together do not expect one to be free because with how they've been monetizing lately I'm pretty sure they're gonna try to just double monetize it. Like if they do two characters at once. Like yeah. I don't think they're gonna give a character out again. They may, so, but you know. Alright, um, Granny, the little cute little lonely yeah, machine. I can just see the game being so satisfying, like hitting shit with her gauntlets. Like because they so, have like the They have like claws when Yeah, you I gotta go look at her because she does. She has like these fucking and she has like a bear too, like a bear in the background too. It's like she's about to fucking rip you or give you a pounding of the of the power of the bear. <laughs> what? I'm, I'm trying to find her. And usually, because usually there's this fucking bear. Cause it's just like. There, <laughs> there is a bear. She does. It's just there funny because it's like it is so fucking random. It's just like this huge ass bear. He's got yeah, like a lazy like... eye. He's like. <laughs> She has a little bear yeah. hair too. Yeah, Granny would be cool to see because she she's an, uh, she is a machine though. If you look at her intimacy, she does she is a machine. I'd I'd fuck with Granny. I think she'd be yeah. really really fun to play. 
She's so damn cute. Yeah. Plus like, she's yeah, one of those she, flat she... booba waifus that are very rare. Honestly, I wouldn't mind if she was the opposite of Sue. Sue being the most mobility, but the most fastest. She being the slowest, but hits the hardest, basically. Your mom hits the uh, hardest. Alright. Uh, um, the Gundam chick. Hmm. I give two fucks about her, dude. She, like, came out and then left. Uh, it's it's because her supporter is not that great. Yeah, she's not very great. Her. I think she's hot, don't get me wrong, but... Like... Yeah, she's just, like, I'm not surprised she's that high because... Uh, yeah, I'm guess not what? either. Like, that's her spot. That's, like, yeah, that, that's and... like exactly where she should be. Yeah, and then, obviously, the... Z yeah, Xenoblade Chronicles, Xenogears, Waifu. Xenogears, Valkyria... Fucking Chronicle Chan. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm a bit surprised she's a little bit. I thought she'll be higher because if you guys have seen her intimacy art, she's actually. It's a pretty fucking absurdly good intimacy art that she has. I think the reason she's so low is because her art style overall is just unique. Yeah. She doesn't really look true. like anything else in the game. Which is, like, unfortunate because I would love to see her playable. Where the fuck is she? Yeah. There she is. Yeah, I see. Yeah, cause yeah, cause she has amazing art. It's just, it's a, it's just I can, I, I, it's just it's probably like how the hell you're gonna transfer that art style to a 3D model, basically. I'm guessing yeah. if that was the case. But yeah, her art is <laughs> also that, reminiscent of like um, the Kana art, like just the way they look, like not back, no way big, like how it's like kind of painted looking. It's like pastels, basically, yeah. in a way. I love how that looks. But while we're here, well, I'm gonna say this. This should be the real playable character. Fuck all of you. This is who should come out. Yeah, uh, yeah, she... Yeah, if for some reason she gets... If you could vote for her next year... I'll... Uh, yeah, but... We'll, we'll, we'll Please see Please vote happens. for her next we year, were... guys. I've had like six people... Reach out to me... And say Lidva should be playable. They're like, I just want to use her. Cause she's like, like look at her. Not to mention she'll be a unique playstyle because she uses bl bl blade blades basically, like actual yeah, blade blades to fucking mom. attack you. So yeah, um, but as I said before, no Coco Elf, no Muddy Grimmery, so you know, pet the sucker. So good. But yeah, going back to the list before we end the video, um. Mm. No, I wanted to open this one. <clears throat> it's, I mean, the choices to me overall that they put in here were weird. Like, why is Haru here? Because some of these, it's you know, like there were, they had an other tab, but most of what ranked here is like what they suggested themselves. So yeah, like basically. shit like Haru, like why is Haru here when there are so many other supporters? Yeah, because, like, I, like I, I would guarantee you this much right now, there's some people that did vote for Francis or Anna Rose basically being playable. Like, I would But I'm surprised. not even thinking about shit that's not in the game or not here. Like, or, well, it, it, it doesn't matter if it's not here, but if it's not in the game, I don't, I'm not really, that's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about, like, why would they suggest Haru over something like Nanami or Yazora? I would, oh, I would, yeah, like, why, okay. like, because like, if they're asking us who we want playable... Like, okay, so if we go to supporters here, so we have all these old supporters. Just gonna go, like, like, okay, so, like, shit, like, fucking, where Major, was she? Her. Where's Fuma? Yeah, Where's Major? Her. Where's, Where's um, Super rares are obviously not off limits. Weren't there super rares listed there, too? Yeah, I think they were. Yeah, that's, that's what I mean. Like, it's like, what, what was the criteria they used? Because, like, he's I, I so ancient. Why wasn't she there? Why wasn't she Onigumo was there. there? People have been asking yeah. for Onigumo in some way, shape, or form for two years. And a freaking... Why isn't this oh, there? That... Yeah, Habiki, I was gonna say. What the hell is Habiki? Yeah, what the like, hell? Look how thick that... Oh, Mari, there's another one. Um, the Go to the... Um, the same role where Habiki is, but the first chick. The same role that oh, she's oh, in, but the first... first girl. Yeah, first one. Yeah, Letitia, like, that's just what yeah, I mean. Letitia, There's a lot yeah. of supporters that, like, are better looking than Haru. 
I, I don't yeah, know why Haru like, was the choice. It's so weird. And and it, they're thicker too, so like that obviously gets people his attention too. So. But like, yeah, I mean, it's it's kind of going off the rails now. But you you know what I mean, like. There's so many other things that could have been there that Grimory could have provided to vote for. Yeah, that is true. Look at her. Look at her. The majestic she is. I believe she was in the voting pool too. Look at look at Grimory's hopes of getting my money going away as I hit the home button. Because they won't make her pay. <laughs> oh, oops, didn't mean to do that. But anyway, um that's the video. I have one last thing to show you guys and then we'll send you off. So, I came across this the other day. It's got nothing to do with anything. But, Nui dressed up as Sue is fucking hot. Thought I'd share. There we go. That's the video. Thank you, Tad. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I don't know about those votes, guys. Uh, yeah, that's like, mostly the community. I yeah, I, I, got, I, got, I got questions for the community, but I'm not going to go in it. I don't want to make anyone feel bad, but... I mean, if you like it, you like it. Different strokes, but, like, I've got questions. <laughs> all I know all I know is that the Ren fans are stroking their eagles really fucking huge, wide right now. Yeah, I know she's that, all bro. sparkly and shiny. I just, I just <laughs> yeah. wonder how, like, it's not a bad turnout. It's just some people are, like, in weird-ass places. Like, I could swap her with her. Like, this should be, like... Anywhere not in the gray. This should be in the gray because she's like irrelevant. This should swap with this. I don't know how like this beat this. I also don't know how Punk and Spice made it all the way up like, there too. Yeah, it's so... I don't know. Well, that's the cool thing about having a bunch of different people vote. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed it. That was your discussion on the user ranking. And of course, Rin won. Because... I mean, yeah. Rin's yeah, probably we be want... playable. Ugh. Yeah, she is. Thick and juicy. Do we wail on her? I may get her, because I do like sword users, so I may get her. Well, there you go. There are feet in your future. Have a good day, everybody. And we'll <laughs> catch you Monday with another video. Toodles!